Have you ever pondered about the magnificent nature of our God? How mighty and awe-inspiring He truly is. First, let us give praise and thanks to our Heavenly Father. We stand in awe of His majesty, His justice, and His unfailing love. He orchestrates the cosmos, yet He cares deeply for each of us. His wisdom surpasses understanding, and His power is without limit. We are grateful for His presence in our lives, guiding us through His Word and Spirit. Today, let us reflect on a profound verse from the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 10, verse 17. For the Lord, your God, is God of gods and Lord of lords, the great God, mighty and awesome, who shows no partiality nor takes a bribe. This verse is nestled in a passage where Moses reminds the Israelites of God's greatness and his acts of deliverance. He recounts their journey from Egypt, their trials, and God's faithful guidance. It's important to recognize that this verse isn't just a statement about God's power. It's a call to understand his character. He is the supreme authority above all other supposed deities and powers. Yet this mighty God is fair and just, not swayed by worldly influences or corruption. In a world where power often corrupts and justice seems fleeting, this verse reassures us that our God is different. He is the ultimate judge, incorruptible and just. It's a reminder that in our pursuit of godliness, we too should strive for fairness and integrity in all our dealings. Our God does not show favoritism and neither should we. In every interaction, let us reflect his justice and impartiality. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for being our fair and just God. Help us to emulate your character in our daily lives, showing no partiality and living with integrity. Guide us to be more like you in our thoughts, words, and actions. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Farewell, beloved brothers and sisters. May the Lord guide and protect you until we meet again. Remember, in every situation, our God reigns supreme, just and true. Stay strong in his truth. God bless you all.